Hi, this is the old man talking. I uh, have, haven't uh, put up a video in quite some time, so I'm interested. I wanted to uh, let all my friends know that I'm still around and still kicking, but uh, I've been kind of busy. We were on vacation in Gainesville, Georgia. And uh, my wife was shopping at a mall with a friend, and she got hit by a car. Now, I was plenty worried, but she lost consciousness for a little bit, but uh, I was with her in the emergency room, and she came out okay. I mean, I was worried that maybe, first, that she might be killed, and second, that, you know, that might not be able to walk, but uh, she was walking with a walker, but anyhow, we had to, I had to concentrate on helping her, you know, be in the hospital, uh, holding the while they did the stitches in her head. She got a, a gash, a skin ripped off the back of her head. <coughs> And they had to be sewed back on. She had a concussion. So I had to set up the motel room, but we got a handicapped room, but then we stayed an extra week so she could endure the trip back and it short drives of, you know, just three hours, four hours max each day. That was all she could take sitting up in the car. And, of course, to add extra problem, <coughs> to add an extra problem to everything, why uh, the car started to make a strange noise when it hit Pennsylvania. And when we stopped that night, I took it to, uh, that afternoon, took it to a dealership, and he said the power steering was shot, so. He did a little, you know, temporary repair that got us home, but so everything turned out, you know, was resolved. But during that time when I was thinking about all these things, I had to plan, I had to figure out how we could eat and uh, help my wife and all that. Why then I got home, I had a lot of things to do to help her and we had visit the docs and uh, contact a lawyer and all that sort of stuff. So my mind was very much occupied <laughs> and I realized a couple of weeks after we were back that my mood, which was depressed when we were on vacation, had bounced back and I was feeling pretty good. So. Uh, Apparently, just concentrating on all those details and not having time to to get my for my black thoughts or whatever you want to call them to get into my brain, actually, right, put me on a high for a little while. It lasted about uh, three, four weeks, and it's dissipated by now. But I just wondered if uh, other bipolars out there had any similar experience of when they were in a really tight spot and had to uh, concentrate on getting certain things done if it broke their depression, at least for, for a short while. And uh, if it has, why, well, let me know. and let you all know that I've been... Uh, watching the videos by uh, Daddy Z and Miguel and uh, Be Strong 4 and the other videos posted by uh, people with uh, mental problems on YouTube and I've enjoyed them and I knew it was time for me to put something up to. So, bye-bye.